Hi guys, it's Simone and welcome to another video. So today I'm going to be unboxing the April box and I'm so excited because it feels like Christmas. <laughs> so I think the theme for this month is Rootless Rivals. So when you open the box, the first thing you see is a spoiler card on top. And it's so pretty. It has like two black women on the cover. So yeah, this is really gorgeous. And this is a spoiler card. The first thing I see on top is Fable Grounds Coffee. So I did see um, All Crate post this on their IG profile while a while back saying that each box will come with their um, coffee. So this is Cinnamon Hazelnut All Crate exclusive. Now I'm not a big coffee person, but I did recently just bought one of those cold brew Starbucks because there are days when I'm really tired and I'm just like, I don't want to have to try to make coffee and I don't own coffee. So why not just have one that's already half made? So maybe I might give this a try or it might just sit in my cupboard. We'll see. Um, it says the Fable Grounds Coffee crafted a deliciously indulgent cinnamon hazelnut coffee blend inspired by the magical competition in Where Dreams Descend. I think I've seen that book. I've never read it, but I've seen it. It kind of gives me that, um, what's that movie? Oh my gosh, with Zendaya and Zac Afron. Oh, it's gonna bug me. But yeah, is that movie, it reminds me of that movie, the cover, and maybe the storyline reminds me of that movie that Zendaya and Zac Afron is, Zac Efron is in. So yeah, so it's quite a yummy way to stay awake and keep reading when night breaks once it releases this summer. And so the next thing I can see here is this box and it says, etc. And ooh, it says, challenge fellow fiction loving friends with categories that were designed just for bookworms. Readers will need to rack their bookish brains to score points in this fast paced game of literary list. <gasps> ooh, this is a game. Oh my gosh. Well, okay. I don't have any, um, Bookish friends per se, I have like maybe one or two, but I would like to play this game. I'm actually just gonna try and open this without the plastic. This is just pretty. Like look at that, you can see the design. Like I would totally love something like this. This is gorgeous, this is absolutely gorgeous. And it just has some cards on the inside. Oh. So this is what it looks like when you take it apart. So this is what it looks like when you take off the cover. It's just pretty, this is just absolutely gorgeous. And this is for ages 14 and up. But yeah, it just has a few cards in it. But um, yeah, I'm actually kind of excited to play this. Oh, this is, this is cool. I was trying to convince my sister and my near and dearest friends to play with me. I know I'm always begging someone to read with me or to play with me. And the one is a run my run. And I think the game cards, where are you? Enjoy challenging your fellow bookworms to a game of literary lists with our etc. guard card game designed exclusively for all create by Tess Modovich at Paperback Bones. We can't wait to see what which creative categories you come up with on the special blank cards. Be sure to tag us, to share and tag us. Aww. So next item here is in a small little box and I want to believe that this is a pen. As I hope. I don't know. It's not really sure what it is. Uh, this is in really tight. Oh! History has its... History has its eyes on you. So it's one of those phone case um, sticky things. Um, I, I don't even know what to describe it, but yeah. I used to have one on my old phone, but this is actually pretty. And I like the fact that this is good gold. Um, who is this, like, what is this inspired by? With our Hamilton inspired phone wallet designed by Lady Chubb Letters, you can conveniently tuck your ID, cards, cash, and key safely away inside for a socially distanced night out with fellow revolutionaries. Oh, this is from Hamilton. I got introduced to it by a friend and that Broadway, I would really like to watch that show on Broadway. Like I would really love to see them on Broadway. But yeah, it, I dropped it. 
So yeah, this is really pretty and I'm actually, I might put this on my phone case. The um, next item in the box is this. Next item in this box is this and I can hear something, what? Oh my goodness, this is so pretty. Oh my gosh, I don't know if you guys can see this without them falling out. Oh my God, so it's falling. But these are chopsticks. Oh my gosh. Let me get closer. And they have words on them. It says the Scarlet Gang. Oh, I know what this is from. This is from These Violent Delights. This has to be, um, where are you? Yep, share a romantic meal with your bitter yet somehow infuriatingly attractive rival with this chopstick set designed by Paperback Bones and inspired by these violent delights. So I don't even know how to use chopsticks, but, but hear me out. These are so pretty that I may actually have to learn how to use them because these are gorgeous, these are so gorgeous. And this is actually two, it's a pair, two pairs. So we got white and gold and red and gold. Oh, these are so pretty. I'm gonna have to wash these and just put them in my kitchen. I could probably practice eating sushi. <laughs> I hope I get to use these because these are so pretty. I don't want them just sitting there like not being used. <laughs> okay, so I've reached the pen now. Oh, wow. Damn. Okay, this pen is absolutely gorgeous. Like, Look at this. This is so pretty. Bringing closer. Oh my God, this is such a pretty pen. Oh, I, I, have, I have my other um, pen from the March box on my bookshelf, um, but this is good. I need, to, I need to figure out where I'm gonna put my pens because they're too beautiful not to be displayed. And I just wanna figure out how to display them properly, but this is so, so, so pretty. I love this. I absolutely love this. <laughs> I'm actually liking this box this month. I wasn't, I'm, I don't know if you guys watch my March unboxing. If you haven't, go check it out. But I wasn't sure if I was gonna get this box and now I'm actually kind of happy that I did. And then, ooh, so we have something here. I'm not sure what it is. It's like clot-like. Let's open this plastic here. Ooh, what is this? Is this a pillowcase? Oh, it's such a, it's a pillowcase. Ooh, this is pretty. I don't even know if this will match my theme in my living room, because I try to do this beach theme in my living room. So I have like yellow and blues and greens, like ocean, like ocean, like colors, but it says conquer your fear and you can conquer the world. Oh, this is so pretty. Like this is absolutely gorgeous. Um, I don't know. This is the measurements for this. Maybe I could fit one of my cushions. But yeah, this is pretty. This is absolutely pretty. I've never gotten a um, cushion cover before, so this is kind of nice. I wish it was two. Um, having one single would just be like having a random pillow, but I think I know where I'll put this. At first I wasn't sure where I was gonna put this, but I do wanna get a overstuffed chair sometime this summer to put in my reading corner. And it, I would put a pillow on there and this would be, this would look nice on a chair. I think the chair I'm looking at is like a yellow, a nice deep yellow from Ikea. If it's still there during the summer, um, it's like not cheap. So I'm like trying to save up for it, but this would look cute in that chair since it would be yellow and then you'd have the red roses and everything on there. This is pretty pretty. And now we have got to, oh, this book. So I already knew what this book was. Well, this was the reason why I decided to get the box and it was because I knew what the, the book was gonna be. But it says, April's Jamaican inspired fantasy debut, which is steeped in gold, features two rival witches who enter into a deadly alliance to take down a common enemy. Enemy. <laughs> oh my gosh. Enemy, okay, I swear. I'm wearing Invisalign and talking in, with Invisalign is just so much difficult than when I didn't have them in. Try, trying to get my gap kind of closed up so yeah, don't study me. <laughs> but yeah, it says, this twisted cat and mouse game set in a richly imagined fantasy world will keep you on the edge of your seat the whole way through. 
Our signed special edition comes with an exclusive cover and letter to all Create subscribers from author C Siannon? Shannon? I don't know how to pronounce her name. Smart. Underneath the dust jacket, you find an exclusive foil stamp on the hardcover case, as well as the reversible dust jacket artwork by artist Tiara Lamadou at Bloody Damn It. Oh, wow. So, oh my gosh, I need to show you guys this um, book cover. So, this is what it looks like in the plastic. And I'm going to take this off. Ooh, and before I take it off, there's the um, author's letter in the back. But this is so pretty. I saw the book cover in the bookstore the other day and I was just like, oh, I can't wait for mine to come. So this isn't even the same exact color as the so book. The original cover, I'll insert a picture so you can see, but it's green. But this is like a really dark black yellow col color. I think I like the green more and this is just because I've been digging green a lot. But this is still gorgeous. Like this is gorgeous. Oh my, oh my god, like, let me just bring you in so you can see like the faces on the cover, but this is, this is absolutely gorgeous. And it's big too, this is not even a, a short book, it's 529, 30, 533 pages, but I must say the words are like a decent, a, they're a decent size, so it's not really small print, so I'm gr grateful for that. Signed by the author right here. So, ooh, and then let's check out the cover. Ooh. So I'm just gonna take the whole jacket off, and this is the first thing you see. Okay, okay, I absolutely like this. This foiling is everything. This foiling is everything. And oh my gosh. Okay, okay, this is the dust jacket. This is the dust jacket, like, it's pretty. It's, let's give it a props, it's pretty. I don't know, oh my gosh, this is so pretty. Okay, okay. I see, I see what you did there. And it's, I don't know if you guys are interested in the author letter, but here's a look at it. But yeah, this is, I, I like this. I like everything this. is gorgeous and I love everything that came in a box. I am not disappointed at all. I did skip the May box because I don't want to be spending so much of my money on these items. Like this can become, like getting a monthly box can become expensive and I'm trying to save some money. So I don't think I'll be getting the May or the June box. I do have a May box coming in from the bookish box. And I believe I'll get it in June because they ship at the end of each month, I believe. So I will have a dot box in June for the May box for the bookish box. And that's the YA bookish box. And then I did finally get on the Illumocrate um, subscription list recently. And I will be getting the May box for that. I don't know when that will come. So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I will link any of the artists mentioned in my description box below. Um, if you ask me what my favorite item is, uh, is the chopsticks. They're just so pretty that, yeah, even though I don't know how to use them, I actually do love to see them. So for aesthetic purposes, I will say these are my favorite. If you like any of the items in the box below, please tell me which one is your favorite. Um, but yeah, and absolutely don't forget the pen. This month's pen was just gorgeous. So yeah. I absolutely love my pen. So I love my pen. I love the chopsticks and I love the game cards. Actually, I love all the items. I actually do. So <laughs> yeah, I can't give you my favorite item. I, I take back what I said earlier. Yeah, I love all the items, including the book. The book is gorgeous. If at least the cover is, I don't know about the actual words inside that make a story, but the cover is gorgeous and yeah. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Please comment your favorite item down below and I will see you in my next video. Bye.